first step is to select the correct hand lever. Now let's check the laser alignment. The sub signal, which is indicated in the top bar here, is good. And the laser is near the center of the detector. Press the thermal tuning button and press start. What you see is the thermal fluctuations of the cantilever. And the blue line indicates a fit to those thermal fluctuations. Using the frequency, the peak frequency, and the Q factor, which is calculated here, we can then calculate the spring constant of the cantilever using the Sater method. Once the spring constant, the changes in the spring constant are small, we can stop the collection of the thermal data and press the Use Calculated Result. Now we see we have a new spring constant set.